Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. In today's video, we're going to be doing another little organizing and a little bit of decluttering of my jewelry collection. So I have a lot of jewelry that I've collected over a long, many, many years of being a teenager. I used to shop for jewelry because it always fit. <laughs> So yeah, I've got a lot to get through. Um, I don't want to like throw everything away, but I definitely want to, you know, not be so overwhelmed and then not picking anything at all or only picking the same things because, you know, I've spent all this money on this stuff over the years. I want to get some use out of it. So let's dive into the multiple drawers of jewelry I have, try and organize it a little bit and get rid of some stuff that's just dated or old you know so yeah let's get into it so at the end of my bed i have these drawers where i keep the jewelry i just have hair stuff in that one um but these two are jewelry i'm thinking of maybe moving the hair stuff to another drawer having it all be jewelry so it can be a bit more spread out so that you can kind of see everything rather than being things being piled on top of each other because it's a bit of a mess at the moment to say the least so yeah definitely need to organize all of this stuff yeah it's it's a bit of a mess i did get a few of these um jewelry organizers from kmart like ages ago i only got one of each kind just to kind of see how it would go but um i probably have to get some more <sighs> fingers crossed they have some more of the same ones at my local kmart so i can actually you know <laughs> continue to use the same ones throughout the whole thing but I just kind of want to grab a few just to see how I would go and see how it look and how it would fit in the drawers because who knows if it's even going to fit. So this is what I have accomplished so far. I've started organizing um, some of the pieces that I know that like are dainty and things like that. That's my current style. Some you know bigger pieces as well. Um, I've currently got this drawer that used to have the hair stuff that had moved and I've got the rest of the containers. And this last drawer is still all the stuff that I need to keep sorting through. It's a much bigger job than I thought it was going to be. And there's a lot of things that I'm struggling to let go of, even though it's not my style and I'll never in the world wear it again. You know, there's just so many sentimental things, things I've gotten from overseas and just stuff like that, that, you know, you just don't want to get rid of. But yeah, slowly but surely I'll get there. It's just trying to force myself to get rid of things and stuff because you know a <laughs> bit of a hoarder but i'm getting there and yeah we shall see there's just you know things that are sentimental like for example this necklace i got from my parents like ages ago and it's all tarnished and old and i still really like it and i want to keep it but i don't know like i need to if you guys have some cleaning tips Please let me know because I would like to at least clean some stuff up just so that I would actually wear it again because it's like sentimental. I don't want to get rid of it. Okay, so I feel like I'm in a position where I've kind of finished um, everything I wanted to do. So instead of using all three drawers, I have just compiled it all down to two and like stacked the organizers. So um, that way it you know frees up an entire drawer for something else so yeah i've really just put in anything that i may or may not you know use in the future just to see how i go with it i didn't really want to commit to you know throwing things away so they're kind of all just like in this box and i'm gonna put them away and see if i ever miss anything out of it and then kind of go through that another day. I just didn't have time and I just wanted to get the stuff out of here. So this is pretty much everything. So I've definitely pared it down a lot. It is definitely a lot more my taste, a lot more dainty and simple. And yeah, I'll see how I go with it, but that's pretty much what I've done. So yeah, let's see if it actually works. And if I, you know, pare things down even further, so, you know, things don't end up out of control. But, yeah, it's, there's still a lot here. I still, I still probably need to do a little bit more. But, yeah, that's that's it for me, I think. See, so, you guys, that was my organization decluttering situation. 
Um, let me know in the comments down below what kind of setup you've got or if you've got any um, recommendations for me and how to make it a bit better. And yeah, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.